what's going on youtube come back at you with another video so we got spider loke speaking more on the situation with bg knockout he also comments on Dresta. basically recently bg knockout had a picture up with young buck he said young buck was solid spider loke wasn't feeling it he kind of went in now people are asking questions about the situation i'm gonna let you see everything that's going on but make sure you go check out Spider Loke Most Easty on YouTube. Shout out to him for letting me use this footage. Definitely appreciate it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Hit the like, subscribe, share on this channel. I appreciate you. Peace. Hey, before I put the little clip out, Cud called me like, hey, Cud, hey, Spider, he's like, you know who this is? I'm like, nah. He's like, who it? I'm like, who it? He's like, it's Naki. I'm like, what up, Cud? He's like, hey, we ain't never fell out, huh? I had no big, big fallout, no big argument or nothing ever. I'm like, nah. He's like, yeah, because there's some motherfucker on my page talking something. I don't know. I said, but I did see you on the uh, thing, uh, co-signing that whole nigga. He's like, yeah, but that's your opinion. I said, what's my opinion? I didn't even say my opinion. He like, yeah, I said, plus, I see you on there all on 50 cent us. He's like, yeah, that's between you and him. I said, what you mean it's between me and him? Cause I already got at you about that shit one time. Cause what y'all don't realize, last year, out of nowhere, I'm just scrolling down my shit. I guess it was 50 Cent birthday. I see this nigga knockouts type of big ass paragraph. All on 50 nuts wishing him a happy birthday. So I made it my business to call cuz first thing in the morning when I seen it. Like, fuck 50 Cent, cuz. Fuck anybody that like him. Fuck her. He like, cuz, what's wrong, cuz? I'm like, fuck cuz. He like, what's up, man? I'm just, what, what? I'm like, cuz, you all on this nigga page, cuz. You supposed to be my homie, cuz. What's happening, cuz? I don't want fuck cuz, cuz. Like, oh, man, I don't even know that nigga. I said, exactly. But you know me. He like, you right, you right. Just be like, calm down, calm down. All right, so that was that. Then, before that, cuz. Like I say, cuz I'm going through Instagram and just out of concern, cuz I look, this nigga got his voice tweaked like sounding like it's some shit like this. He got the filters on like the bitches be doing with the doggy puppy shit with some specs. And he talking and his face is smooth, perfect, like computer generated makeup, like just perfect. I'm like, cuz he ain't doing a series of it. I'm like, damn, cuz keep doing this shit, cuz. So. I had already planned to go to Vegas primarily to fuck with Cuz and CJ Mac to get some footage for that understood video. So I shoot me, the homie AJ from Tana, Puto, and the homie uh pay from No Love, cuz we on a road trip to go to Vegas to fuck with my two crips, cuz. So while we on the thing, I'm looking, this I start noticing the, the filters while I'm on my way to Vegas, cuz and I see them. And I'm like, cuz, what's up with the homie, cuz? When the homie from No Love see it, he like, cuz, me and Knockout with Sally's cuz, and the pen, cuz, that's my Sally. Knockout just know I'm coming to fuck with him to Vegas to get some footage. He don't know who I'm with. So I'm like, cuz, you with Sally? I'm like, cuz, you gotta speak up when we get there, cuz, I gotta get that cuz about this shit. This shit ain't cool, cuz. So it's like an intervention. So me and the Crips, we put up at cuz, huh? Immediately. First thing on my mouth. Cause what's up with the filters and all that shit? That shit ain't cool, cuz. Why, why, why? All the details, whatever. He like tried to defend his position like it was cool and all that. Woo, woo, woo. So I'm like, but on Crip I bet you can't go find them motherfuckers on Spags. Look toward the summer of 2017 or right after that. I guess he got the point. Somebody else must have gotten his gear. But when he called me the other day, he like, that's between you and him and you and him and opinion and all that. And I'm thinking to myself, cuz. When your bitch ass was calling me when I was going to beat the motherfucking brakes off of TJ Santana because his whole ass did a record speaking some whole shit on my business and with another nigga that ain't got nothing to do with him speaking my name and on the song he want to do a motherfucking talking part where he like, here yeah, Spider, gang, y'all both bigger than me. So if you, when you see me, if you want to beat me up, then go ahead. All right, on Crip, because that's what I have planned on doing. But when the nigga knock you, Parole, I embraced cuz not knowing he was claiming this nigga TJ Santana to be his brother, cuz. So I don't really believe it's cuz brother, brother, but so I already had my intention on doing a certain thing to cuz. Happened to mention it to cuz, and cuz get into this long begging me not to do so. Long, long, long talk, long. So on some homie shit, cuz, I changed my intentions, and TJ Santana got a pass, cuz I was gonna fuck cuz off on my dead homies, cuz, cuz got a pass, cuz a knockout. So 
I'm like, all right. Then, because brother, prior to that, his other brother, Dresden, got caught up on the pedophile shit, cuz. On Crip. So, you know, he was on the motherfucking register. Name, that shit said he was guilty of doing lascivious acts to a minor with a foreign object. Penetration, he used words like that with his picture, cuz. So, talking about following anybody trend, nigga, I started this shit, nigga. I was on the internet back then, speaking about it candidly, being a father of two young ladies, saying, I don't have time to try to explain to my daughters about no nigga on this website why it's okay for him to be there. If he on there, it ain't cool. And I didn't bring it up. Somebody, a fan, had brought it up, and I was giving my perspective on it. This nigga knockout called me once again, pleading and debating and arguing and fussing about trying to explain to me how his brother got caught up and uh, I shouldn't be speaking about it like that. I'm like, cuz, check this out. I don't give a fuck how a nigga got up in that position. My thing is, I got two daughters I'm raising, and I'm gonna tell them everybody on that fake on that page on that website runs from it. So, but his whole thing was getting at me about another nigga. Now here it is. So niggas, he don't don't give a fuck about him. He ain't never did nothing with. I done did a gang of records for Cuz. I'd have been out here promoting Cuz, trying to help his legacy stay alive. He jump on the dick of a nigga he know I don't give a fuck about Cuz. And then when he called me, I didn't call Cuz, when he called me, just wanted, wanted to talk about it, he gonna say, oh, that's between, that ain't none of my business. All right, that shit between me and TJ Santana wasn't in your business. Me speaking about the pedophilia activities of your other brother wasn't none of your business, nigga, but you still got in the middle of that whole ass, nigga. That shit do Demetrius. Fig, what up, cuz? Okay. I see you.